Okay, guys. Um. Well, my flap finally worked, and um. Yeah, I'm on my Lumi right now. So um. Just wanted to show you my uh, Lumi's attack range after I changed them up to 161. Um, it was pretty much a pain. Cause like, all LHC room was like, full, 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 full. And I was like, how can I enter a, a PT? And then I finally found one and got up to 161. So um, this is my attack range without buffs. Uh, I got, I, I have 35% critical and I'm in light mode. The attack range is I guess you can say okay for uh do me average maybe. I'm probably weak but my guild member said it was okay. So um, I just got totem and after uh after the um red leaf red high leaf was uh gone so I just got him. I didn't have enough points to buy the other one, so I got. I finally changed this from 12 decks to uh, 3 percent uh, to gain 53 HP and MP, which is, I guess, better than Dex, but I don't actually need Dex. But um, yeah, nothing changed really. I still like the 4 percent intelligence, which is so awesome. Uh, okay, so um. I'm just gonna be uh, showing you my attack range. With hey guys, um, I finally fixed my flap thing. It took like I don't know five, six days or something. So um, in this episode, in, no, not episode, but uh, in this video, I'm going to show you um my luminous attack strength, like attack range before. Like, do you remember how it was like 20 to 21k I think at level 143? It changed like dramatically. Uh, the same thing. Like, I noticed by my hyper skills that uh, I had to reset because uh, I kind of ac accidentally put one on Apocalypse Extra Target, which I don't need. So. I'm gonna put on <coughs> uh, reinforcement for Ender, extra target for Ender, um, spread for reflection and reinforcement for reflection. But um, right now this is my attack strength. Yeah, it changed a lot. Um, I I enjoyed playing my Hayato right now, but I'm gonna record it later. So um. Yeah, so that's my luminous attack string, or attack range, should I, say. I should say. So, um, let's get on. That's pretty powerful, I guess. I need to get my three orbs first. Ooh, ooh. And that's how it is for uh, the three orbs. That already made a huge difference to my 20 to 21k, and I already reached past it. So, this well, it kind of makes sense because I am high level right now. I, I think I have hit by 18 levels. Yeah. Then you know my next one. But uh, let's check it out with buff. So let me get my 16 thingy real quick, and uh, I'll see you guys uh, then. And I need one more, and there you go. So that's my attack uh, attack range with buffs on. That's a really huge difference. I think it's like by 7 8k difference, which is a lot to me. But I don't know about you pros out there, but. Uh, this is pretty much a lot to me. To me right now, I'm pretty average. At... Oh yeah, you guys did see uh, the Hayato helmet. Well, um, I got the hot time, so uh, it's because uh, I wanted the what is it? Enhancement scroll. I used it. It failed, but luckily it didn't destroy. So I'm happy for that. I was really hoping for it to work, because then I'll be like so strong right now. 
not so strong, it's just gonna be like eight stars. So um yeah. Um let me show you my I got a totem, so yeah. My rod, uh I got it to epic instead of rare which gave which gave me like twelve decks. Uh I guess the rare is better than twelve decks. So um, yeah, that's my thing. Three stars still. Um, nothing changed really. Uh, let's see here, have it has it changed? Let's check. Yeah, nothing changed. Alright, yeah, nothing changed. But um, yeah, guys, that's my luminous. Uh, I really want the. Mass label for a, uh, what is it called? I need to find it. D Dark Crescendo. <clears throat> Cause Dark Crescendo actually helps me out a lot. But, uh... Yeah guys, uh, next time when I make my video, uh, video, um... I'm just gonna be showing you, uh, another episode of Let's Play for Elon, and, uh, I'll be seeing you guys next time.